and show other people that there's life after drugs. There's hope that you can have a future. This summer, a Roan State student is celebrating a college degree and 10 years of sobriety. Her success comes in a particularly difficult year for those struggling with addiction. The Knox County District Attorney's Office says 197 people have died from suspected overdoses in Knox County, including six this month. Reporter Grace King introduces us to Keisha Thrower, her journey to recovery and how she's giving back. I'm a good man. For Keisha Thrower, life hasn't been easy. I uh, started abusing drugs at the age of nine. I had a lot of sexual abuse and trauma in my childhood. At 19, she says her addiction took a turn for the worst. A very broken, damaged young woman. I got with a guy that introduced me to Oxycontin. Selling drugs was her life until she landed in jail. I prayed in jail. Um, I prayed, you know, for God to either let me die or help me because my life was a mess and I needed help. From there, she went to a halfway house and became a peer recovery specialist, helping others with their journey and continuing her own. Sometimes my life feels like a dream. This summer, she's celebrating another milestone, graduating from Roan State Community College with a degree. I had encouragement that I needed to succeed in college. Encouragement from her college and her family. My kids know my whole entire journey. Um, I want them to be proud of me. I want them to be able to go to college. I want to be able to help buy their first car. It's a message of hope that Thrower wants to share with others. Help can be just one call away. I just encourage people to reach out. It is possible um, to have the life that you dream of. It may take you a while to get there, uh, but with God at the center of your life, anything is possible. I'm Grace King reporting.